Welcome to this tutorial where I will show you how to work with the templates in Album DS. Album DS templates are divided in several folders. At the right part of the templates tab, you can see the list of these folders. By checking one of them, the templates included in this folder are shown at left. You may check any combination of folders. If you press the right mouse button while over these folders, you will get a menu to select all folders, unselect them or filter the templates. Filtering can be done by number of pictures and also by a combination of vertical and horizontal pictures. Once the filter is activated, only templates fulfilling this condition are shown. Remember to deactivate the filtering option by clicking at Done Filter once you are done. Filtering is based on the last part of the template name. Therefore, it's important to name your own templates following this method. Two digits for the total number of pictures using zero at first it needed. Two digits for the vertical pictures and two more for the horizontal, making a total of six digits. Templates have his own menu available by right-clicking the mouse over a template. Please notice that some options are applied to the selected templates instead of the one where the mouse is currently to allow working with multiple selections. The options available with this menu are as follows. Preview Templates Opens a preview in a larger size at right of the templates list. The preview can be resized using the arrow indicator at bottom and by resizing the Album DS panel. Each time the mouse position changes, the preview will be updated with a new template. Template Catalog This option shows all templates included with the full version of Album DS in a folder-by-folder folder way. Templates not included in the demo version or not installed in the full version are framed in red. To return to the working templates list, please right-click on the template preview and select Template List. Mark as used. Once you have opened a template by double-clicking on it, the template will be marked as used and is framed with the same color of the used pictures. The user templates control is saved in the album database. But you may also manually mark a template as used for any other purpose like a previous selection or for discarding purposes. Just select the templates to be marked and use this menu option. Mark as unused. Some as the previous feature, but you, as, you may imagine this option removes the used mark from the template. Open template at sites originally created. As you already know, Album DS automatically resizes the templates to the album size when opening them, but sometimes you may prefer to use pre-designed templates in different sizes, like for framing pictures in a collection of 10x10, 10x12 or 10x15 prints. This can easily be done with this option. You need to create the templates in the sizes and resolution you prefer, creating both the vertical and the horizontal version of it. If you take a look at the template folders metric and inches, you will understand what I mean. Let's open a template from the inches folder using this option. As you can see, the size is already defined and not related with the album size you have input. Now, you only need to place a picture by double-clicking on it and save the work. If you prefer not to save this as a sheet in PSD and JPG format, you may use Photoshop saving option. Open and adjust to album size without changing shapes. This feature allows for opening the template resizing it to the album size, but without modifying the original template design. This way circles remain round and squares remain square, but obviously the original design may not fit completely the album sheet size. Of course, once the template is open, you may manually resize the shape layers and make them fit better your style. Open left side of template. Opens the indicated template in Photoshop but using only the left side for it. This side will be extended to fill the whole album size input at the album tab. Open right side of template. Same as with the previous option, but using the right side instead. 
Auto fill template with same image in batch mode. Fills the selected template with all pictures selected in the pictures tab, but repeating the same picture for each shape layer of the template. This feature is indicated for creating collages to be cut out later, like school or Christmas calendars, like shown in this template. Number all shape layer positions. By using this option, Album DS will add a layer to the template, numbering the shape layers included. Remember that the application uses the order in the layer panel to fill automatically a template. With this tool, you will see a graphic representation of this order. Create picture proof with this template. This option will create a copy of the pictures using the selected template as design. This way you can easily add a frame, a signature or a watermark to your pictures before then sending them to a customer. Proof pictures are saved into a folder you will be prompted to select. Fill selected templates with selected pictures. This option is new with this version of Album DS and it's a great feature. It will fill all the selected templates with all the selected pictures in the Pictures tab, respecting the order in which they have been selected, both templates and pictures. That means it will open the first template selected in Photoshop, fill it with the first, second, third, etc. pictures, save the template as sheet and close it. Then it will open the second template and fill it with the next pictures, and so on until there are no more templates or pictures. These new sheets will be saved in the last folder used for saving a sheet and added to the Sheets tab in Album DS.